New details tonight. If you're looking to see the movie The Interview, you can now download it online. Today's release of the movie, along with limited showings in theaters tomorrow, comes after the U.S. government says North Korea launched a cyber attack on Sony Pictures. Kyra 7's Natasha Chen has more. The interview is now being streamed online, an even earlier release than anticipated. By going to Google Play, YouTube, Xbox Video, or SeeTheInterview.com, you can pay $5.99 to rent it for 48 hours or buy it for $14.99. I know that for a lot of theater operators, that was, that was, a, that was a deal breaker. David McRae, the owner and operator of Arc Lodge Cinema in Columbia City, said he knew Sony Pictures would distribute it online, even while it would be playing in his theater. The R-rated comedy about taking down the North Korean dictator was first canceled after the U.S. government said North Korea hacked into Sony Pictures files and threatened to wreak havoc on theaters showing the film. Now 300 theaters will show it on Christmas Day, even with the movie online. I think people are curious to see it and I think they want to see it in a movie theater. That's what actor and director Seth Rogen says too. He tweeted, a comedy is best viewed in a theater full of people, so if you can, I'd watch it like that or call some friends over. McRae has the movie ready to play on this hard drive. He said what started out as just a fun bromance turned into a statement of freedom of speech. You know, I compare it to uh, Charlie Chaplin doing The Great Dictator. Uh, and the Marx Brothers when they did Duck Soup. It's out there for people to make the choice, and that in this country we do have the right to do. Well, Natasha found out the Ark Lodge and three other theaters showing the movie say they will still have the first showing tomorrow, no earlier. That is the agreement they have with Sony.